morning guys and welcome back to my channel aj tweeted and said that tonight's episode is gonna be real good but don't throw anything at the tv and i was like girl no promises I am coming at you live in my Christmas pajamas because I am super excited for Christmas even though it's already it's only November um but I am the type that I'm gonna move you ooh I'm gonna move you over here I am the type that likes to celebrate slash decorate for Christmas in November because and I'm just disclaimer not simply because I'm trying to forget about Thanksgiving I am not I love food but I just like to be holly jolly for more than 25 days and it has been psychologically proven that those who decorate for Christmas earlier are happier people so there you go if you couldn't tell by the title for today's video I am going to be getting my life together and also talking about Corona minds, of course today is Tuesday it is my day off and so normally on Tuesdays I like to normally wake up early which i didn't do today because it is currently 11:56, so i'm doing really well i woke up at like 10 which was not what i wanted but i guess i was really tired and i slept in until 10 o'clock so mainly today what i'm going to be doing is cleaning my room because my room is a mess and i hate that so when i say cleaning my room i mean literally cleaning it i clean everything i put away extra clothes where i can fit them i wipe down countertops all of that fun stuff. So yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you do and subscribe down below if you haven't already subscribed to my channel. And without further ado, let's roll the fast clip. <laughs> I had to switch to my phone camera because my actual camera battery was dead so I have it charging and actually both of my camera batteries were dead so they are currently charging so we'll just have to make do with my phone camera quality but anyway I have pretty much finished making my bed and I'll show you it just looks so, I have to show you this way it looks so cozy and just I love it when my bed is all made it makes me very very happy but now I am I can't with these windows these windows give you such great lighting but then they make the camera all weird anyway now that I've made my bed I think I'm going to start kind of cleaning the dust off of everything because there's a lot of dust around here so let's do that it has been a little bit of time since I last picked up the camera but I have decided to do a little things a little differently today I have moved some things around in my room because I've decided that today I'm going to be decorating my room for Christmas and that means I will be going to the store later on today to get some Christmas pillows, a Christmas blanket, and I think I'm going to be putting some garland around my headboard. But since kind of moving back home from college and everything, I had to rearrange things in my room because I used to put my Christmas tree over there. Um, yes, I have a Christmas tree specifically for my bedroom. Um, I used to have it over there in that corner, but now I have that bookshelf, so I had to kind of rearrange things in my room if I wanted to put my Christmas tree up. So, what I did was in... So, right, this is my bed, obviously. I had to wash my comforter because my dog got stuff on it. Um, right by my bed, I used to have a nightstand, which I have right here. It used to be kind of over here. And I used to have a little basket of blankets and extra pillows right here by my closet so what i decided to do is move that basket over there right by my bookshelf and i'm going to put my christmas tree right here by my bed it's not super wide it's mainly tall i believe it's like six feet tall so i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to put that like i said right here in this corner i moved my nightstand over closer to my bed so that i have more space and if i'm able to i'll move it back to where i had it originally but for now i'm going to keep it there and then i am going to decorate so let's 
get that I cleaned all of my stuff but all of the stuff to decorate my bedroom is downstairs in the basement so I'm gonna have to get that yeah I'm really excited so let's go A little longer than a few minutes later. Hello, everyone. How's it going? <laughs> I can't deal with you. We're at Target. <laughs> oh, you wouldn't know <laughs> that. Is it the thing it's where the tea, the tea is like going in and out at Target? Like, you see the Target, the sign? Well, well there's no letters anymore. Well, if they watch anymore. Jess and Gabe on YouTube, which you don't. No. But if you did, then you would know because Gabe does that all the time. I don't know, but anyway. We're at Target getting We're at Christmas Target stuff. so I could finish decorating for Christmas. This is my first cameo appearance. Oh, I can't, I can't. That, there you are. That, that's okay. That's your face. <laughs> anyway. Anyway, now let's go inside so I can pee. I have to tinkle. I can't, but all right. Going we'll see you in there. Catch you on the flip. <laughs> Catch you on the flip side. Yes. <laughs> it's like a red blanket and a green pillow. Yes. And a nutcracker. Look at him. He's gold and pretty. Going right there. Hi, welcome to Target. <laughs> making our way, making our way to the Christmas aisle, but we're in the. Toy aisle. Walk in so no we're going Why to Why are the we in the toys? Board games, board games. Board games. Um okay. Santa? Hello? This is the main workshop. Between Hi. building a teddy bear for Alice and a race car for Tommy, we're assembling your gift oh, for right Alex. now. We're short. Hi Santa. Wait, I was ho, ho, to Santa. This is Santa speaking. Are you excited for Christmas? Very. It's my favorite time of the year. Me too. Ho, ho, ho. I'll be coming soon. Bye-bye. Okay. I'll be waiting. I'm calling the cops. No. That's creepy. <laughs> so, I think the last time that I picked up the camera, I was at Target. But now I am clearly back home and yeah. I have pretty much decorated my room for the most part. I am just waiting for my boyfriend to get back here so that we could finish decorating my Christmas tree. So I have all the lights on it because I needed to get another pack of lights, which is what I got from Target. So from Target, I got another pack of lights. I got a Christmas pillow, which I'm so excited about. Oh my gosh, it's so comfortable. And so, my comforter itself is white, so I have my white comforter. I got this green and white pillow with the red pom-poms on it. Then I got this red blanket, which is so soft and I absolutely love it. The only thing I will say is that it like sheds. So my bed, like I said, is white. And so you can kind of see all of the little red like stuff on my bed. I think I just need to wash or not wash, put the new blanket in the dryer just so that I can kind of get rid of all of that. But I will show you what I've got going on here. Also, aside from that, I got a nutcracker. I'm so excited about it. So I will show you kind of where I put it. The nutcracker itself 
is right on my dresser and I love it. It says 2019, so that's really, really cute. Um, and then my bed itself looks like this. I really like how the pillow is green with a little bit of red and then the blanket itself is red and it's super, super soft and it just looks like a knitted sweater and I love it so much. Ready? Yep. Okay. Oh, it's recording. What oh. did you think it was doing? I thought it was... No, I just... When you said, are you ready? I thought you were going to press We got all the ornaments. <laughs> well... The bread scored! <laughs> <laughs> Are they still Who losing? It? Yeah, by one though. Oh. Okay. Well, if you lose by one, you these lose are by ten. These aren't all the so ornaments, awesome. but these are the ornaments. We already put up three? Four. Our first one, which is Central Central. Our first Park. one has a couple. Aww. Aww. How sweet. Thank okay. You. And then we have Santa's Magic Key because gotta have that for Santa. Even though he comes down the chimney. Um, not if you don't have a chimney. <laughs> <laughs> the sleigh bells ring. Are you listening? In the lane, the snow is glistening. A beautiful sight, we're happy tonight. We did it. Good job. We did it. Now, my room for right now is decorated for Christmas. Anyway, I also have fake presents under the tree to make it more look more realistic. Yeah, I'm not in the frame. There we go. I know that. But anyway, that's that's it, I think. Okay, my nerds. Sign oh, it. you know what I say all the yep. time? Signing well, off. That, that's not how I do it. Catch you on the flip. Later. <laughs> that's it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up. Link down in the description. <laughs> the link for what? I don't know. I just hear a lot of people say that. Yeah. No, just subscribe if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. Peace out, my nerds. Peace out, my nerds. <laughs> okay, bye. It is currently the next day, and I realized that yesterday I said that I was going to talk about Criminal Minds, and I never did that. So we're going to do that. What I wanted to talk about in regards to Criminal Minds is just pretty much what we know so far and what's going to happen this season. I am so excited but i saw a article on twitter yesterday about what we know so far and i'm gonna talk about it so let's find the article first and then i retweeted it ha i found it Ooh, so exciting i like have mixed emotions i'm excited for the new season but i am incredibly sad for the new season like this video if you agree anyway Okay, moving on. So, obviously we know when the show is premiering, and the show is premiering on Wednesday, January 8th, and I'm so excited. It's also just so weird that we haven't started watching Criminal Minds yet, because normally it's on in October. And here we are, and it's not October, it's almost December, and we still haven't seen any Criminal Minds, and I don't know how I feel about it, but it's fine. Um, and it's going to be a two hour season premiere. So we know that the season premiere is going to be two hours and the season finale is going to be two hours. So essentially that's two episodes. So we're getting the first two episodes on the first night and the last two episodes on the last night, if that makes sense. So in this article, it says we are going to pick up six months after where we left off in season 14. So there's going to be a time jump, but... Despite the fact that there will be a time jump, we are going to know immediately what happens with the whole JJ and Reed situation. And if you saw my video I posted about the JJ and Reed situation, I will link it somewhere around here, uh, probably in the like info card. But anyway, if you saw that, you know how I feel about that. So if you haven't watched it, go watch it. If not, then you know. Or if you have, then you know. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so we're going to know immediately what happens with that whole situation. 
and I'm not ready, but I am super ready at the same exact time. So they're not gonna make us wait for it. Like we're gonna know right away. So thank you to Erica Messer for that. Okay, so we know that an unsub is gonna be returning and the returning unsub is gonna be from the episode Chameleon last season, which was the one that AJ directed. And he apparently is into some gruesome stuff. That's what, um, who was it that said that? Daniel Henney had said that in an interview that he's into some gruesome stuff. So. He's coming back, and I do really like when they bring back unsubs and they kind of, like, make it a season-long thing. So I'm kind of hoping that that's what they do, but I'm interested to see what they do with that. And we all um, immediately know that um, one of the characters is going to be in danger. And honestly, I have a feeling it's going to be Rossi, because this unsub had... He let Rossi live, essentially. So, I feel like it's gonna be Rossi, but I could be wrong. Comment down below who you think the team member in danger is gonna be. Because it could be anyone. And I'm not ready for it, but it's gonna be fine. We're gonna get to see Reed's mom again, so I'm so excited about that. I love her. And then, it also says that it one of the things was when it was filmed, and obviously it was filmed last May and that's when they wrapped and I'm just so sad and they're just they're starting to like come back on social media and start talking about the show since it's coming back in two months and I'm just really emotional about it so yeah okay and lastly the last episode is going to air on February 19th and when it does air, it's going back to its original time slot of 9, 8 central. So it won't be at 10 p.m. It'll be at 9 p.m. And I'm just really, really excited. And I hope that you guys are too. It is just so sad that the show is over and or it's going to be over and I'm not ready. But again, I'm so ready. So yeah. Now this is really going to be it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you do. And remember to leave those comments down below on who you think the unsub is is going to be af going after this season. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out, nerds.